y'all, I got this, I got this segment I'm start doing because I be having some issues, a little bit of issue, and I can't, you know, I, I address them to the teacher, but I try, I can't address it like I want to, cause they like Shirley, Shirley, don't don't say Shirley, don't get a put out Shirley, that type of stuff. You don't want them to mistreat her, Shirley, all that stuff like that. Okay, cool, I understand that. Listen. I just picked two to up out from in Head Start, right? She three. So she go to Head Start. Head Start. And four. <coughs> and four. They go to pre K. And at five, they go to kindergarten. So two to Head Start. Mind you, two to potty train, everything. Okay. This what pissed me off today. This today. I got some more that done pissed me off before then, but today is today that this done pissed me off. Now, y'all, let me know on there if I'm wrong. Because I'm trying to go about this thing. Y'all know the Lord working on me with my mouth and all that because I done prayed to him. Let me stop cursing. Let me be able to speak. You know, lady like, because I it just come out. And man, okay. So, I gonna pick Tudor up from school today. Tell them hey, to Tell them hey. Oh, y'all can't still call the angel right there. My angel. Uh, my garden angel. Listen. I pick her up. She walking funny. I'm like, Tudor, what's wrong with your pants? She said, it my panties, my panties. I said, yo, panties. So I pulled her to the side. Tudor panties rolled all the way down, y'all. Down there by her freaking thighs. Down there to her knees. Why they ain't help her pull her panties up? So me, I turned around for the march back. The teacher must have saw me, cause she came down. I said, excuse me, why y'all didn't um, help her pull her panties up? That's part of potty training. I, Tootie is potty trained already. And if y'all helping the kids and y'all training them, when you see they don't get them all the way up, why don't you just help them get them up? Now that's part of potty training. What kind of man that lady made me so dang on mad? That lady made me so mad. I think she lazy. I think that's a lazy. I think she lazy. Cause two is three. She can go to the pot. She can tell when she got a pot. She wear panties. Some of the kids in there in pull ups. Some of them in there in pull up. Okay. That's the parent problem because they probably had them children potty train before they went to the, the, the uh the uh three anyway to head start because head start don't accept some of them if they're not potty trained. But in order for you just to help them pull up their underwear, you can help her pull up her underwear. She right now walking funny and everything. I'm not I'm noticing why she walking. We walking to the truck. Finna walk, we in the bed and finna walk out to the truck. Man, that lady made me so dang on mad. I just wanted to say, you old lazy nothing. You just lazy as hell. How you deal with kids and see that they still need some more help and you ain't helping her pull her panties all the way up? Oh, it just made me mad. And I ain't trying to say that to the need. Special privileges, treat her like a princess, all that kind of stuff like that. No, I'm not saying that. But you'll have some type of feeling in some type of way <coughs> if I send her to school with no panties on. Since she ain't gonna help her pull them up. If I send her with, with, with her to school with no panties on, then with. Um, Hunter, Hunter didn't have on any underwear today. Wonder why? Who wanna walk around with they um underwear rolled down like that? Do you not know how uncomfortable that feeling is? She just make me, she just, I just be wanting to just, I'm telling y'all, I'm telling y'all on Jesus' heart, that's how serious I am. I'm not playing about it. I just be wanting to, I just be wanting to just, man, I just want to pop real fast. I just be want to pop real fast to her face. She be making me mad. I hate that when you're dealing with kids, you supposed to help them kids. Get your lazy nothing. Out. Get out the way then. Get somebody in here who gonna genuinely help these kids, okay? 
You didn't pull your underwear all the way up. Pull your underwear up first. Okay, uh -uh. they still down. Pull them up, baby. They rolled up. They rolled up like you finna fold them up and put them in the drawer like you done washed them. I'm so mad. She just a lazy. And then she turned around. She pissed me out with the panties today. Last week she pissed me off because I go pick Tootie up. Her mama drop her off. I go pick her up. Okay. Pick her up. Tootie. I go to, you know how children run to you? Hey, Gigi, hey, and grab for the hug. Two the wet. Yes, baby. Yes, dry. Yeah, you dry. Dry. yeah, you dry today. Two the wet. All this down here wet on both sides. So I'm like, okay. What happened here? <coughs> well, she had a time with her sleeves today. And when they washed their hands, she got water on this. Okay, that's explainable. She has two change of clothes in her cubby. Two change of clothes in her cubby. You could have switched her shirt out. Yeah, you rolled them up. You rolled her sleeves up. When you rolled the sleeves up, they were still wet. <coughs> and it was holding the moisture. Fold it up like that. Because it went flat out so it could dry. It's rolled up three, four times. Why you then go in her cubby and get out another shirt and put her on another shirt? What was the issue? What kind of training that was? It just made me mad, y'all. And I know you're trying to let the kids to be independent and all that. But even at home, when you help your children be independent, after they wash their hands, you tell them, push the sleeves up. After they wash their hands, you, you get them a napkin for them to dry their hands and all that. If they get wet, you pull the shirt off and put another one on. So what was the excuse for that? And then, the week prior to that, to that, come here. I'm going to let you sit right here. Come here. Come here. Up. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, uh, come up here with Gigi. Okay. Sit, 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 sit. Can you tell the people? Can you tell the people what your favorite color is? What's your favorite color? Pink. Huh? Pink. You heard her say her favorite color pink. I'm going to show y'all a picture tomorrow. Where they have Tootie, um favorite color on the board as being black. Tootie don't like no. Tootie don't like no black. She ain't never. She ain't never like no black. She just sat there and told you what her favorite color was. You got her with black. That mean y'all ain't listening. Let me turn my hat down. Make me mad. Are you the grandmama? You just so having us so spoiled. You just can't. Now, this I can. Because I understand when things are right and things are beneficial to her. And it's for her growth and everything. I understand that. But when you just a lazy nothing... That irks my, that chaps my heart, really, because you in the job of, you know, dealing with kids. And when you're dealing with kids, you shouldn't deal with kids just to say <clears throat> you are a educator or, uh, you know, oh. for titles and stuff. I want a teacher that's going to that, that's gonna be all the way, all the way. So, y'all, this my episode one, because I'm pretty sure this ain't going to be it. Cause this is episode one. You putting off your earrings, baby? Y'all, this is date. Well, not date. Um, I don't know what I'm tired of these. I don't know if I'm tired of dilemmas, chronicles, episodes, or what. But just tell me. Because I approached it today. I approached it. Wait. 
So tell me how should I handle this? Because I said something to her today. The other couple of days I ain't said that too. I was just like, Lord, okay, Shirley. Take a woosa. Take a woosa. Don't make a mountain out of a mole here. You got the earring Yeah, I got it, baby. But this right here is is it this is just I mean some of this stuff is just just as a human and as as a nurturer and all that as a as a parent as a teacher put it right there when you see that you ought to hop on there and be like oh no baby we can't have you with him wet the air conditioner already on you know let's let's switch the shirt so you don't get sick wait it's a world world it was. <coughs> What? You just your words. Stop talking like that, girl. You talk so good. What you talking about? What? Who? Uh, uh. We ain't gonna do that. We ain't even finna do that. You be on the camera telling people you like stuff, you don't like stuff, and all kind of everything. You can talk. Sit down. Don't act like that. But y'all, let me tell you something. Put it in the comment down below on how should I handle this. Because I said something today. I ain't said it like I wanted to say it, but I said to let her know that I was upset about it and I was perturbed about it. Okay, all right, y'all. As I always tell y'all, in the meantime and in between times, you want to take her shoes off, y'all. We waiting on my Joe. I think these little shoes are so cute. Y'all remember these? We used to wear these back in the day. Y'all can't even see them. They pink. With the orange in the back. They the K-Swiss. Oh, Lord. Y'all can't even get a good look at these. Anywho. All right, y'all. Come on, wait. I'm gonna help you, baby. I'm gonna help you. As I always tell y'all, what in the meantime and in between time, tell them to say love on somebody, love on somebody, love on somebody, and love on somebody, y'all. Bye. Bye.